Just look at the badges. Do I have to say anything else? He finna get quick first step at 99, and he's seven foot tall with max wingspan, and he got all the contact dunk animations. <laughs> yeah, y'all saw that build? Seven foot with contact dunks? Like, what build is better than this one? Y'all literally saw the badges, and y'all must think he's slow. He's gonna have 84 speed as a seven foot player at 99 with 93 vertical. And yes, you're supposed to play him at center. He gets a couple more badges at center. Don't play him at power forward. If you think you get more badges at power forward when you're seven foot, you don't. You literally don't. All right, let's get into the build. Make him seven foot, lowest weight, and make him max wingspan. Ain't nobody gonna stop you. You seven foot. You seven foot with 95 post looks too. You can dunk, shoot three. You have unpluckable quick first step. You got special delivery. You got dimer. You got floor general. What? Bro, this guy, oh my goodness, but it was so good. God damn, mama me. Oh shit. Now y'all wanna put max finishing everything beside post control. Put post control at 27, so you get 23. Get an extra finishing badge. Now what you wanna do, max out your mid-range, three point, but put your free throw at 28. Now max out your playmaking. You can put your playmaking all the way up. You finna, oh my, this build finna be crazy. This is a real Jokic build. I don't know what to tell y'all. Now you do you do get quick first step at gold at uh, 99. You get quick first step as a seven foot player. I print your interior defense and perimeter defense at 70. Both of them at 70. Now you do not need interior. You knew you do need a little bit of interior. You do because it got buffed, but 70 interior is just fine. I have 84 interior on my other six for nine paint beast. Now max out your physicals besides stamina. Put stamina at 91 and don't touch your strength. Literally, don't touch it. Don't touch your strength. Your strength's gonna go up by putting uh, your interior D up. Now I was just messing around here, just checking if I can get more badges. If you want, you can customize your build. You don't have to copy my stats exactly. You can do something else. If you want more defending badges, put the post control down. Put the standing dunk uh, to 90 and then you can get more defending badges. But I want more, more weight, more badges. I wanted more finishing badges. Now here is the takeover. Now I went with, uh, I would go with uh, box out, the glass cleaning tape, the glass cleaning, because that's like, I, I went to stuff blocks with my 6'9 paint beast. He's good and all, but eh. you go, now you gonna go with slashing or uh, spot up. Limited range is kind of ass, but I'll go spot up just to stretch out the floor even more. Cause when you play a racket, if you can stretch the floor as a center when you're seven foot, and they don't think you can shoot cause you're seven foot. You finna shoot. You finna shoot all the time. Now the similarities are, that makes no sense. None of them can shoot or, or play me. Clint Capella cannot shoot or play me. Hassan Whiteside cannot shoot or play me. Does not make no sense. Now I'm gonna show you how to put the badges. Now, obviously, you can put whatever you want, but I'm, I'm gonna put high zone hunter and catch and shoot. I'm putting high zone hunter for my post scoring capabilities, even though I don't have no post control. I can still post score. And I'm gonna put catch and shoot just for wreck. I'm gonna be open on, on the left flank or the right flank. Someone's gonna leave me open. I'm gonna stretch the shoulder. The center thing, I can't shoot. Boom! Catch and shoot. Catch and shoot, boom. You can put something else if you want to if you're not playing. I know most, most of y'all gonna play it. Y'all can put a uh, sniper, stopping top, uh, dead eye. Yeah, high zone, I just put that because of uh, my post point kid. But now this is where it gets hit. This is where it gets spicy. This is where it gets way on guard. It up, bro. Now remember, you a center and you have Hall of Fame Diamond and Floor General and you got quick first step and unpluckable. Now you could put both of them at gold and have special delivery. And you can put special delivery out of them if you want to instead of Diamond or Floor General. Bro, this is literally the best center build. Link, go into this, uh, my comments and link me a video that's better than this. This center build is the best. There's no other center build that's better than mine. None. This is literally mine, bro. 
If this gets popular, this is my build. If someone steals my shit, I'm gonna beat the shit out you. Now, there's three badges you're supposed to put. Even if you, like, three major badges. Intimidator, Rain Protector, and Rebound Chaser. At Hall of Fame all the time. And I put Box and Worm. Those are especially for rebounding. You can put whatever you want, remember. I'm just telling you. I'm just advising you. Now, Worm is really overlooked. I don't know why I don't think Worm is good. Especially for Wreck. If there's a Wreck, bro, Worm is essential that you need because everyone's going to box you out. You're not gonna, if you have Worm, you can slide through that bitch. It's like, like your Dennis Rodman, bro. Dennis Rodman has Hall of Fame Worm. I know he does. Box out. You need Hall of Fame Box out because if they have Worm, they're not, it's not going to be. I don't think. Yeah, I just have Hall of Fame Box out. You really need it. You can have chase down block and take out worm. If you don't like worm, you can take worm out for chase down block or brick wall. Screens really got nerfed. They did. Like literally, it got nerfed. I can tell. I've been playing this game for a long time. It's not the same way. Even with Hall, I mean, I didn't test it with Hall of Fame brick wall, but I did it with gold brick wall. But you got 57 strength. I don't even think it's gonna work. Strength doesn't really matter. So like, yeah. All right, this is the end of the video, I guess. All right, so it's not the end of the video, but let's recap what we can do at, with this build. So basically, it's Jokic with that perimeter defend. That's like why this build is so good. You can perimeter defend, contact dunks, post score, shoot threes. Look at the block. Look at the rebound. Even the offensive rebound is good. You have you're gonna have 84 speed with um 93 vertical. If you have the 99 boost in gym rat, this build is just an all round beast. It's the best center build in the game. Show me if if you got a uh, uh this if you got a video. Post, uh, give me it in the comments, post in the description, not the description, the comments, just give me a link, let me click on it, it's not better than my build, literally it's not, my build is 7 foot, suck my dick, I'm out, but when it comes up on this bitch, I'm out, bitch, bitch. Yeah. yeah, I know these niggas watch, I know they, I know I know these niggas watch, I know these niggas fly, I know these niggas fly. Sneak this, sneak this, and how you bitch miss me? In the kitchen, water with him, boy, we being in it. I know these niggas watch, I know these niggas watch, fly. I know these niggas fly, I know these niggas fly, trying to call 12 on this, you bitch.